Yes, if you look at my name and my profile pic, you know that I'm an Eagles fan. But the reason why I'm upset about this play really has nothing to do with how this play may or may not have impacted the outcome of this game. The Eagles are 8-1 right now. Everyone loses. It's not a big deal whatsoever. I would be furious about this if this was a game between the Jets and the Raiders. Hell, I would be upset about this if this was a Cowboys player getting face masked by an Eagles player. The reason why I'm truly upset about this is as follows. Dallas Goddard, the Eagles tight end who's getting face masked right here on this play, it was just announced this morning that he'll be missing significant time due to the injury that he suffered on this play. A play. The face mask tackle that was deemed a penalty decades and decades ago because it got players hurt. And for some godforsaken reason, the official that was standing right there, about 15-20 feet away from the play happening, decided not to call a penalty on it. So now we have a situation where a player is now seriously injured because of an outlawed play that a flag was not even thrown on. I don't care which team you root for, that is a very damning mark on the NFL, and they're officiating especially. In a league that preaches all the time on how they want to better protect their players, and constantly gives out 15-yard penalties for so much as breathing on a quarterback, they seriously took a long, hard look at this play, they didn't see anything wrong with it, or dangerous about it, and they kept their flag in their pocket. Why? Because he's actually trying to run forward and get some extra yards? Is it because he's not a defenseless player like a quarterback usually is? Honestly, this is just a very rough situation that this league is going to have to deal with now. Because this was a prime time game and a large amount of people were exposed to this garbage on a national scale. Everyone can now see that all that talk about making the game safer for their players means absolutely nothing when you have empty headed unqualified idiots on the sideline who aren't man enough to make the correct call. I seriously hope that Goddard can recover from his injury, and I seriously hope that the NFL takes a long, hard look at what happened right here and takes action accordingly.